Yep, that's a Malzahar top, all right. Oh boy, this is not gonna be fun. I hate Malzahar, he's a stupid champion. I get why they gave him a spell shield, but I don't get why they made his primary damaging ability have a 650 range without any need for skill. If it was a skill shot, 650 range is fair, but it's not a skill shot. Its range should be no more than my stretching strike. Because it's not a skill shot. He doesn't need skill to use it. All right, I'm just going to try and get Spirit Visage as quickly as I can and endure. I think I might also try. Uh -oh. Okay, the Gragas is fine. Yeah, Misfortune's fine. It's unfortunate that Yasuo wasn't in position. If Yasuo was here, it would have stopped the invade all on its own. Instead, Grog doesn't need to go back now. Hopefully he won't miss anything. I don't think he will. I hope He didn't flash, I don't think. No, he did. He had to flash, and then he had to level the bear, uh, the uh, E. Hmm. Oh, four, oh, yes. Oh, whoops. I'm coming. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. I'm here. I'm here. I made it. I'm here. Sorry. Well, Malzahar levels his E first, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, that's your problem now. I, I actually stayed too long. I don't think I'll lose anything, but I definitely stayed too long. I might actually lose a CS here. Probably going to lose something. Never mind. I'm getting all of it. What the hell? You were just waiting in there the entire time? You creep. Dude. What a creep this guy is. But that's the thing. Malzahar level maxes E first, if I'm not mistaken. And that ability is a non-skill shot. And his silence is definitely not something he maxes first. The Voidlings are ridiculous. They do a ton of damage. They didn't used to do as much damage as they do now. But yeah, he's... I mean, see, this is the stupid part. He's just going to shove it in. I can't really stop him. Not even sure if I'm gonna be able to get this CS to try though. Yeah, I got it. Good. Yeah, I'm missing that. Oh, well, we're even on CS. That's not bad. But yeah, I hate. I just hate his laning strategy. Huh? I killed your void link. Do look at that. Now, there's something I didn't realize could actually happen. That's right, keep auto-attacking. He's gonna keep killing your boy things. He's... But yeah, it does do a lot of damage. No, nope, Thunderlord said got it. That's all I wanted. Uh, yikes. Whoa! Scary there. You don't have any mana. No mana means you can't kill. I'm gonna lose that. Probably gonna lose that one too. Mm, I'm okay. He got my passive, but he's got no mana. He can't finish it. Once I recombine, I'm coming for you. Nah, he's leaving. Does he have teleport? I think he does. Yeah, he does. Alright, well, let's shove this out as much as I can. Because it's shoving out anyways. I can't stop that. Yeah, broke his shield, so that's something. Yeah, see, I can't stop this. This is all he's going to do. This is not a fun lane to deal with. At least I'm getting some free CS off of those. Ow. 
He is burning through his mana pretty fast. Hopefully Gragas... Ah, Gragas is walking right through Vision. Ah. Oh, I am so screwed. I'm dead. Karshavano would be here. The Grog has walked right through Vision. He walked right through enemy Vision. I should have known Shivana would be here. That was such a waste. And I couldn't get any of my skill shots on him, so he had his spell shield. Uh, I just... I hate Malzahar's kid. I hate Malzahar in general. He's another one of those champions that's just not fun to play against. Just not fun. Riot needs to focus on making champions fun. And not... I mean... Malzar, what does he do? He drops his E, he drops his minion thing, and then he just he just steps back and waits. Because that alone will clear waves. And if you try and engage on him, he's got this shield. And since he can use his abilities from such long range, you have to take some sort of risk in order to actually break his shield. Which is incredibly stupid. It's just not a fun play pack. He did burn his teleport, though, so I can freeze it here. I mean, there's very little counterplay. The only counterplay is ganks. That's it. In the laning phase, you actually have zero counterplay in what you can actually do to win the lane. Get this? Yeah, barely. There's no counterplay. It's sit back and take the damage. That's basically it. At least if you're playing a champion like Zeng, there's no counterplay. Other champions with abilities that are similarly long range maybe can do something against him, but since Zeng doesn't have those abilities, it just sucks. And it sucks that Gragas did not come and gank earlier when it would have. Uh, you have two more of the AFK things. Good. I got me a CS and some healing. Alright, good. I think I got him. Yeah, I think he's dead. He's definitely dead. Got him. Good. That's the only way I beat him. The only way I beat him is when he fucks up massively, and he just fucked up massively. Good. So there, I got a kill now. And just teleports down so I can take an advantage uh, in a pretty big way here. That's good. I now have a CS lead, a kill lead, an XP lead. Good. I'm now winning. I'm not winning by much, but I am winning. Let's get this and this. Yeah, this is good. Cool. All right. Um, yeah. What is this strange? Damn it, Kyle, please. No, no, no troll, please. No, that was all on him. That What he just did, he, ju he got too close. He didn't have his spell shield because I broke it off. And he did not respect my damage. That was him fucking up massive. Huh? Now your shield's down. And he missed all of his skill shots, too. And he's... Oh, interesting. That was a waste. That was a complete waste. Cool. He just burned... He just burned his ultimate and got nothing for it. Great. His shield just came back up. And he's out of mana. No mana means no kill. And he did burn his ultimate, so he doesn't even have that going for him now. It's interesting. Why didn't another Voidling spawn? I could have sworn that the Voidling spawn multiple times the moment they hit you. He didn't spawn. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the Malzahar is backing. I think he's got teleport. 
I think by now his teleport's up, so... Hmm. Missing a bit of CS here. But yeah, yeah, he teleported. Oh, he didn't teleport. He's still here. And he's gonna... He's tanking. Interesting. Yep, this is good. I now have a decent advantage against him. Oh, wait. I did not mean to back into that. You done yet? I see. Get me out of here. I probably shouldn't have used my E there. But I'm pretty sure I can kill this Malzahar. If he lets me. Are you going to let me? Oh, you are. Got him. Good! I'll take it. I will take it. Wait, what? Uh, well, got her flash. That's acceptable. I got you. <laughs> Why didn't she ult? She could have just ulted and saved herself a flash. That was weird. I she I don't know why. Why the ultimate would have been so much cheaper. And it's too bad. If I had a little bit more health, when I stretching striked her there, I would have been able to build enough distance and then be able to E away, and then she would have had to ult. Um Okay, well it's um it's, it's got some health. Damn it, I'm still running the 30% page. I kind of don't want to be. Because this is one of those cases where getting up this would be great. Mm. Yeah, liking furry art and being a furry are two very different things. I don't know why I just said that out loud, but it was in the chat, so I had to respond. Oh, your shield's down. And guess what? Now that your shield's down and my ult's up and I got ignite, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, there's. Oh, I'll be damned. He's actually gonna get away. I'll be fucking damned. He, he actually survived. Well. Flash for Ignite, that's a good trade. I would have much preferred killing him, but I'll take what I can get. This Malzar is absolutely disrespecting my damage. Bad news is, right now, I can afford to do that. I can't do it. That spell shield means I just don't have enough damage to guarantee I'll kill him. Because he'll block the E, my Q and W will hit him, but if I can't get an auto attack off as well, I, the Thunderlords won't proc. And then it doesn't even matter. Nice. Nice. Misfortune just got a double. Got it. Whew. Close. But right now, I am winning this lane quite nicely. I have a CS lead, which I should not have. Nalzar is one of the best farming champions to bring into a lane. Seriously, he farms so easily. He just drops his uh, E... Summons his Voidlings, and there you go. That kills the whole wave. You don't need to do anything. Just sit back and watch the wave die. Huh? What? No! I'm so dead. I am... Not dead. Whoo! Whoo -wee! I am not dead. That was uh, blisteringly close. And now I've healed. That's fine. Damage his shields back up. I should just leave. I can't leave though. He's so low on health. I really want to kill him. No. Damn it. <laughs> He baited me there. 
He baited me. He's backing. Oh, he's not. Interesting. God damn, I really want to kill you! Let me kill you! Blame the new Congo Republic. What? I don't understand. I don't think I'm supposed to understand. Oh, he warded! He warded. Cute. I guess that makes sense. After the last... Oh. And... Oh, why'd I do that? I could have killed him with ease. Why did I do that? I could have killed him with ease there. Why did I do that? Oh, I still can't. Still can. Screw you, Malzahar. By the way, Malzahar should be winning this lane. Since I'm not getting any help, he should be winning. This is uh, very silly that he's not. And good night, tomato juice. It's nice having you around. Russian guy, tomato juice, whatever. It's nice having you around. Alright, good. Let's get some damage. Let's make this uh, Malzahar regret ever picking this champion. Well, let's get some damage. What is he building, anyways? Yeah, Morella Namcon's not a bad choice. My healing is definitely the deciding factor here. Because if it wasn't for my healing, there's no way I would have killed him. I would have been solo on health. Wouldn't have happened. Malzahar, come back. Don't you want to play with me? After the last few times the two of us have been playing together, things haven't been going so well for you. Time to shove this out. I don't think he's actually leaving the lane, but I do want to punish him anyways. Yeah, I kind of agree. I mean, I, I, I'm i not going to criticize somebody for what they do in the privacy of their own home or whatever, but, um, yeah, the one thing is that the furry culture has very sexual undertones. And this stream is not about that sort of... Is this guy seriously fighting me? Are you seriously fighting me? Okay. I, I thought you learned your lesson. I was mistaken. You clearly didn't learn your lesson. But yeah, in general, we try and keep this stream of a non-sexual nature, so. Although I don't, I mean, although I'm not going to criticize you for what you do in your private life, I'd rather stay private. The only things that we talk about of a sexual nature here is the over-sexualization of the characters in League of Legends, because my god, my god, the women all have massive breasts and perfect figures, except for, I think, um, there's like three champions that don't. That meant, hey, the fuck, get the fuck back! Oh, okay, never mind, I'm not, I'm sorry, I, I regret everything. I'm out of here. Oh, I don't have my ult. Oh, I do have my ult. Help me! <laughs> they sent so many for me. <laughs> they sent so many. Um, I had no armor either, which is a problem. Tarek, I definitely find over-sexualized, but he's the only male character, except for maybe Varus, who's over-sexualized. Otherwise, almost all of them are just standard sort of 
people. They're not exactly over-sexualized or anything. The female characters, almost each and every one of them. I think Alawi is one of the few that isn't over-sexualized. Um, Janna. Uh, no, Janna's over-sexualized. Um, Jinx isn't over-sexualized. Um, oh, God. Run. Um, you need... Oh, you're dead. <laughs> you're, you're, you're dead. Um, that was cute, but it wasn't... It was never gonna work. But yeah, I do find it disturbing how much they've over-sexualized it. But in the end, I understand why. Sex sells. And skins are their primary revenue source. So if you make the characters look incredibly sexy, it might just get more sales. So I understand why Ryan does. But yeah, there are very few male champions that are actually overtly over-sexual. I should probably go help. Well, that sucks. Misfortune just died. Um, we gotta be careful. Uh oh. Ooh, good dash. If he didn't dash there, that would have been bad. This game is far from GG, but their team is dead. Uh oh. They got the dragon and Grogus is dead. Wait, what the fucking hell just happened? Uh oh, well, we're killing him. That's something, I guess. Uh, this was a mistake. I got her! Run, Alistar, run! He's gone. Should have saved all there, he yes. Yeah, I agree, he should have. He wasted his ult just getting the thresh. Oh? Oh, miss- No! No, misfortune. <laughs> But, I think they will get a kill. Nice. That ultimate was so badly timed. My god. That ultimate was so badly timed. <laughs> like, literally, the moment she starts her ultimate, ultimate canceled. Um, you probably didn't need to heal. Right, look at her go! Look at her go! Wow, this Misfortune's actually doing pretty well. The problem is, right now, the Yasuo... He's very fed, and he died. We can't afford to have Yasuo dying. He's, he's got too many kills. I also can't, um, can't have ultimates that only hit one target. I mean, my ultimate did hit more than one target, but at first, it just hit the one. And it really sucks that the Thresh flayed me out of my last. Oh no, he hooked me out of my last extension. Right uh, oh, this should be good. Oh, he missed. If he landed that, that would have been amazing. No, Grogus! Grogus! Oh my god, Grogus, that ultimate! Oh! Oh my god, that ultimate! This is the reason why I don't like going Zack with Grogus. I. There's no synergy. It's, it's negative synergy. There is negative synergy. Team's going this way. I'll stick. With you. There is negative synergy on Krakus. Oh, they're going for Baron. No, they're not going for Baron. Bad Malzar. Bad. Die. Yeah, they're going for Baron. Let's try and take an inhibitor. We should be able to get an inhibitor. I hope they can stop that. Um. No. Uh, Yasuo? Really? Really, yes? Really? Good, at least our team did pick up a bunch of kills. Out of here. Please. Not killing me that easily. 
That was cute, though. That was really cute. He timed his ultimate so that it would follow me. Still not gonna stop me. That was pretty funny, though. It was really funny. It was very well done by the, uh, the Zed. Very well done, but in the end, I mean, they got the Baron, but it was not worth. Absolutely not. They lost, they lost two towers and almost an inhibitor. That was, uh, they should have lost three, though. Yeah, so, the Yasuo didn't just go brain dead on me there. We would have gotten, um, that inhibitor tower for sure, and maybe the inhibitor as well. That was such a... Oof. Yes, report him for being fat. Wait, why am I not killing this? Yeah. Can we really... Oh, that just went down. I don't have any wards. Yeah, I really want us to push. But they know I'm here. Yeah, they do have two Baron buffs, but just two. Yeah, so it has GA. We got a back away. We can't. We can't, we got no teammates here. Yeah, bot bottom does make sense. I really wish we'd go for mid though. Yeah, I'm I'm coming to help her because it looks like they're coming towards her. Uh, just kill this ward, please. Uh oh. Um. That's not bad. We got the inhib. That's good enough. Let's just get out. Inhibitor is good enough. Let's. Good. That one. And yes, we will get up. I hit her. Gotcha. No! If I could have landed that E, I would have killed her. Damn it. Yeah, the vein was just skirting the fights and getting kills. That's unfortunate. We ended up losing there. Ah! Uh, whoa. Uh, yeah, you should run. Yeah, sadly, the team just wasn't focusing either the vein... Uh, the team just wasn't focusing Vayne. That was the problem. The Vayne picked up a triple there. She was 2-4 and four before that. And now they're going to pick up another tower. That's... that's they, they ended up winning there. We got an inhibitor, but... Uh, I feel like... Uh, nah, stop trying. Stop trying. It's unfortunate. That, how did that not work out for us? Alright, let's get some more armor. And some more armor. That's right. Let's just stack that armor. Wait. Let's just wait for this. Okay, we got a drag. Wait. But how did they get a dragon? Sh Shivana wasn't there. And Grog is had smite. You're gonna ask the impossible, aren't you? They, wow, they just got a Mountain Drake for no reason. They should not have gotten it. Four death stance. What? I'm not as squishy as I look. Oh, yeah, they're all there. Hi there. Ow. It stings. That sucks. I, I did my E too late. I was surprised to see the Zed there, to be honest. I'm just gonna wait here. Um, then 
and we go in. And then I die. Kill the vein! Kill the fucking vein! Why am I the only one going for the vein? Yeah, we can lose this game. We're way up in towers, but we're losing these fights. We could lose this game. One too many lost... Their team scales so much better than ours. Their Zed's the only person on their team that doesn't scale particularly well. And he's an assassin. If he gets a kill, he's done his job. Yeah, we need to, uh, we need to get up to the Baron area. Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing to that poor dog? That's right, you better run. That's not a good word. Wait, are we really doing this? Seems like a bad idea. Seems like such a bad idea. Um. Yep. I was right. This indeed seemed like a bad idea. We did get the Baron, though. Excuse me. I got the Baron. I have the single and only Baron buff left, and it costs just four people. Four lives for Baron. That's worth, right? Why did we do that? I don't have my ult. I'm not going to be able to defend shit here. I don't think I can defend this tower. No. I can't defend it. I need to wait for my team. Alright, Alistair's up. My will be up soon. Got you! You son of a bitch! I'm gonna kill you, Vayne! I got you! Yes! Thank you, the Alistar baited that out beautifully. Okay, that's good. That is, yeah, actually we should we should go for the inhibies, right? I've got, we could end the game. We might be able to end the game on this. With my Baron buff, we might, that might be the mistake that cost them the game. I need you to heal. Uh, we should be able to get at least two inhibitors. That's fine. Just take the tower. I can tank this thing long enough for us to take the tower, and now we get the inhib too. That's two inhibitors off of that mistake, and we're gonna get another kill. Awesome. Awesome! Oh, that grog is ult. Alright, good. That's really huge. Oh. Coming! How you guys doing? I'm here to fuck your day up! Beautiful! That's game. That's game. That is done! It's donezo. That was a huge mistake the Vayne made that got her killed. And then she made the mistake again. Beautiful. Uh, can you guys not fight the dragon, please? Just please not fight the dragon. Or I guess now we can fight. Look at all that CC! Nice! That's game. Woo! God, that was so fucking close. Oh, it was so much closer than it needed to be. The funny part was me having the Baron allowed us... Actually, it did nothing. Um, the Baron buff literally did nothing for us. Uh, it, they, they fucked up. They, 
I can't believe it. The Alistar actually made the game-winning play by f by making the vein tumble so that I can land my E right on her. And when I did, she was dead. There was there was no survival at that point. Dear God, that was beautiful. All right, is he? Uh, he's in a game. 